shopping for school clothes two days ago. I know, but that's the kind of thing best friends are supposed to say on the first day of school. <laughs> hey, some of the greatest stars in the world have gone to the Manhattan School of the Arts. And now it's our turn. Aren't you a little nervous? No, I am so ready. And we are going to turn it out, Miss Joan. Okay. Turn girls, girls, girls. Are they pretty girls, girls, girls? <laughs> hey, wait a minute. I know that girl. Yeah, hey, oh, look out! <laughs> Are they okay? Of course! What would the Manhattan School of Arts be without stuntmen? Chicago, <laughs> way to go! My whole family was excited this morning, and now I'm ready and I'm hyped. And I'm nauseous. Oh, girl, come on. Wait. I just want to remember this moment. Really see, hear, touch, and taste everything in front of me. Diana, if you lit that door, I will really throw up. Renee, we're about to take our first step on the road to fame and fortune. When I was a child, I wondered what my life would be. When I lost my way, my dreams were always there to guide me. Was insecure and sometimes had my doubts. But when I start to lose my faith, a voice inside me shouts. No, I won't ever stop till my dreams are reality. And even though the road is rough, I wanna live on my fantasy. No, I won't ever stop till my dreams are reality. And even though the road is rough. Get ready, Nay. From now on, it's all jelly. Good morning, students. This is Principal Rojas. I'd like to welcome all of you back to school, especially the talented freshman class joining us this year. Maritza, the one and only superstar diva in the flesh. Where'd that hair come from? <laughs> My roots. You know, the hair store on Pelham Parkway. <laughs> it's a brand new me. I'll probably be getting a record deal any day now, and you two can say you knew me when. When you lost your mind. <laughs> oh, that's right. You're trying to be a comedian now. <laughs> well, that outfit's funny. <laughs> I pity her. I pity the horse whose hair she stole. <laughs> Look, how many times can I say I'm sorry? Try 800 times. Because that's how much my digicam costs. You know I had to use all my graduation money? Spent my summer flipping almost all beef patties? <laughs> smelling like recycled grease? Yeah, I was going to say something about that. <laughs> sorry. Look, it wasn't that easy Steering a go-ped and carrying a mandolin. Play that thing? Yeah. And drums, guitar, bass, piano, clarinet, violin, French horn. You're gonna horn. be playing a harp at the pearly gates if I lost my footage. <laughs> oh. Oh, great. There she goes. Whoa. She's cute. Yeah. I gotta find her. This is the holy trio of Latina superstars and my role models. The actress, the icon, and the teen idol. Now this is the holy trio of hot boys and my future husband. The hunk, the poppy chulo, and the reason to never lose your groove okay. in the first place. God bless your mothers. <laughs> uh, excuse me. This is my locker. 
Um, actually, I was assigned to Locker 138. Uh, I hate to bust your bubble, but so was he. Guess we're sharing. <laughs> Ooh, I uh, think I'm gonna like it here. <laughs> Come on, Tom, we gotta get to drama. Uh-uh, I gotta get this Locker thing straightened out first. I'll meet you. Things are not going good. My schedule says I have to take ballet. Me! Lamar Mui Macho Johnson. It's not gonna happen. Uh-uh. No way. Uh. Man, you're a jinx. Stay away from me. As drama majors, you'll also have to study voice, speech, dance, and... I'm sorry I'm late. Guess what? 30 students were picked to share lockers and my number came up. Hello, can we talk about my luck? So now Excuse I gotta me. show... Miss... Oh, Morales. Taina Morales. Uh, Miss Morales, uh, what's the first rule of a professional actor? Um, be nice to your fans. <laughs> no. The first rule of a professional actor is to show up on time. Now take your seat and be quiet. Okay, where was I? Voice, speech, dance. These are the basics. This is some sort of mistake. I, I mean, I can't take ballet. Guys aren't meant to stretch like... like that. What about Nuria? Parishnikov? Nijinsky? Well, that's a Russian thing. My American body wouldn't understand. Well, your body had better get a translator. And be in class tomorrow wearing tights. I bet you won't see Spike Lee wearing tights. Believe me, no one wants to see that. Let's start off with some monologues. Who's brave enough to go first? Oh, maybe me, I can do brave. I'll go first. I'm brave. Come on up. <sighs> I I'll have to warm up a little bit first. I think you're warmed up now. Oh, yeah. Okay. Whew. Okay. This monologue is from the movie Rooftop Cop, starring Jennifer Lopez. Okay. I'm playing Jennifer Lopez. So I'm chasing this perp across the roof, even though I'm afraid of heights. Stop! Stop, you dirtbag! I jump from one roof to another. But what he doesn't know is I'm an Olympic long jump champ! So, blam, blam, kapow, piece of cake. So, Jennifer Lopez, I mean me, I keep chasing him, right? I'm chasing him. Then he tries to jump from one roof to another, but he slips. Now I got this punk right where I want him. you die because I'm a woman? Well, I'm tough. I was tough enough to see it through when you put my partner in a wheelchair. I'm tough enough to stick it out. Even though the whole squad blames me, I gotta support my three kids all alone because you killed my famous daddy! <laughs> I'm tough enough to let you live because I'm a real woman. That's it, that's the end. Now this, ladies and gentlemen, is an example of acting. Like a fool. Oh. <laughs> a fool, but... The whole class thought I was great, didn't you guys? <laughs> well, I chose that monologue because those are the kind of parts I want to play. Strong women! Action parts. I want to be the hero, Mr. Colon. That's fine. But you have to choose material worthy of an artist. And work on it seriously. I want you to find a new monologue and prepare it for the next class. Uh, how can I do all that by next class? Uh, if you can't commit and do the assignment, then perhaps you're not cut out for the School of the Arts, Miss Morales. All right. Who's next? <laughs> Come on, everybody. Don't be shy. <laughs> It's 
getting late. Where is she? It's a long trip from Manhattan back to Queens. She'll be here soon. <laughs> She's probably signing autographs or something. <laughs> She's not famous yet. So what? She's famous to me, okay? That's her. I'll get it. Is Taina so famous now she can't use a key to let herself in? <laughs> Never mind. It's only Rosa. Muchas gracias, papi. How nice to be blinded and insulted before I step in the door. Esta familia. Chibi Rosa! My sweetie, Santito. How was your first day of school? Poopy. Santito? It was poopy, Mommy. The goldfish poop and the rabbit poop. And some boy named Paul stepped in some poop in the schoolyard. <laughs> <laughs> there she is. My star, mi estrella. <laughs> What's the matter, Taina? Nothing. <gasps> Something's always wrong in you. <gasps> I think I went to the wrong school. You had the wrong address? I should have taken the train with her this morning. No, Juelito. I had the right building. I just went to the wrong school. I guess she had a poopy day, too. <laughs> What's the matter, Taino? Some boy broke your heart, right, Nana? <laughs> no, Titi, it's, it's not about a boy. It's my drama teacher, Mr. Colon. He doesn't think I'm talented. Not talented? Do you want me to go up to that school and tell him off? I'll go, too. If anybody will go, I'll go. No, 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 please. I know you guys want to help, but I can handle this on my own. Okay? Okay. Don't worry, Chuleta. Your star will rise again. Hey, Bobby, will you stop calling her poor chop? She lost all her baby fat years ago. I don't care. She will always be a poor chop to me. Right, Chuleta? Name. Was I that bad? Uh, no. Mr. Colon had no business coming out of his face like he did. If it was me, I would have been like, if you're such a great actor, why are you teaching in a high? Mr. Colon, how are you doing? I can't wait for your class tomorrow. Okay, bye. <laughs> why does Mr. Colon hate me so much? I had a conductor who was real tough on me at band camp. Figures. That they're all tough? No, that you went to band camp. <laughs> Look, I was just trying to help. Just because you can get into my locker doesn't mean you can get into my business, too. Nay, I got so much work to do. I gotta memorize the periodic table for chemistry and write an essay on Joan of Arc for history. Joan of Arc? Who cares about her? Now, if it was Joan of Rivers, I can get with that. <laughs> Nay, look. Oh, you know I'm going to get partnered with him. <laughs> Everyone, find a spot at the bar. Miss Trumbull. First position, second position, and demi plie. Uh, now that you mention it, it is a little chilly up in here. Well, I hear the principal's office is toasty. I'll take it over. <laughs> oh, uh, you like my leather horse and yaw? Uh, I was gonna wear my thong, but I figured these would be more tasteful. Oh. Now, if you'd cut the comedy and take a spot at the bar, maybe we can have class. <laughs> Doesn't that look like Lamar Johnson from second grade? You mean Lamar Shin? Yeah. 
Lamartian. <laughs> Lamar Johnson! Taina Morales. Girl, I knew I recognized you. You look good. And you haven't changed a bit. Raising that. Are you the only one, or do leprechauns run in your family? <laughs> All right, class. First position, second position, and demi plié. We had some good times. <laughs> Remember that time you pushed us on that spinning disc thingy in the playground? Oh, yeah, yeah. And Renee was always screaming, Let me off! Let me off! <laughs> so I did. <laughs> <laughs> you could have stopped it first. <laughs> For real, Lamar, when you moved to Brooklyn, I really missed you. Oh, yeah. Oh, you did, did you? Yeah, I mean, you were my homie, you know, like a brother to me. <laughs> a brother? Yep, a lollipop head, not beneath, ashy elbow brother who never used quite enough lotion. <laughs> Gee, thanks. Mm. You know what, I gotta go. My Joan of Arc essay isn't gonna write itself. <laughs> oh, Joan of Arc, oh, she was cool. Till she got burned at the stake for being a witch. Wow. Maybe reading about her won't be as boring as I thought. You should read the play about her life. A great part. Hey, maybe I can... What? I'll tell you later. I have to go to the library. I'll see you guys. So, uh, I guess you see me as a brother too, huh? No. I see you more like a fungus. <laughs> Taina, Taina, come on, wake up, wake up. I will dare and dare until the day I die. What's the matter with you? Huh, oh. I was up all night memorizing my Joan of Arc monologue. Oh, I'm gonna be late for drama. You slept with that poor strip on? Oh, ow. Oh, mommy, it won't come off. Well, you're not supposed to sleep with it overnight, Nana. This thing is gonna rip the skin off my nose. Oh, Bente, come on. <laughs> Ever since I started going to this school, I can't get anything right. I give up. Look, Taina, when I was six, my family and I moved here to New York from Puerto Rico. And, and none of you spoke a word of English. I know, Mommy, I know. Ow! Don't interrupt. <laughs> Every day I felt like I was walking through a cloud. People talking yak, yak, yak all around me. I didn't understand what they were saying. <laughs> I wanted to give up. But my mother said, Nena, you're a Latina. You have strong blood. You know she was right. I made it. And so will you. Ow! <laughs> How can I make it looking like this? Mom! Nena, you're a Morales woman. You'll make it. <laughs> now, come on. Get up, get dressed, and get out of here. Come on. <laughs> I know you will be glad to see me burnt, but if I go through the fire, I shall go through it to their hearts forever and ever. And so, God be with me. Scene. <laughs> it wasn't rooftop cop, but I was touched. Now that's a monologue worthy of an actress. Good work, Taina. Oh, and that makeup on your nose is a nice touch. Hey. Hi. Look, um, I'm really sorry for the way I acted the other day. When I feel miserable, I kind of spread it around. <laughs> Why don't we start over again? My name is Taina Morales. Daniel McDaniel. But they call me D-Mac. Who calls you that? No one yet, but that, that's what I want to be called by my friends. Oh. <laughs> okay, D-Mac. Now that you can spread around. <laughs> You 
write that? Yeah. That's kind of fly. Thanks. When I was a child, I wondered what my life would be. When I lost my way, my dreams were always there to guide me. Was insecure and sometimes had my doubts. But when I start to lose my faith, a voice inside me shouts. No, I can't wait to see my name in lights. No one's gonna stop me. You'll see, I will go far. What's your name? Zaida. Zaida. I always have dreams of me being a star. You'll be saying my name. I've got love in my heart. I can play any part. I got games. You'll be saying my name. See my star shine bright. I can reach any high. What's my name? Yeah. No, I won't ever stop. I won't stop. Taina was taped in front of a live studio audience in Nickelodeon Studios at Universal Studios Florida.